進める世界に荒坂社は全力で答えます明るい未来のためのため、hey, to see who。れば平和は常にあなたのものになる。Looking for a ripper dock goes by fingers. Know where I can find him? Who's asking? And why? Got a problem with an implant. Not from around here. Couldn't find another ripper in the city to patch you up? Red Fingers was the best. Yeah, the best for joy girls. Are you a whore? An escort for special tastes. Looking for a ripper who can cater to my special needs. Good. Fingers will like you. Let him through. You will be when every mox in town descends on this shithole. You got a financial claim? Take it to court, you Fuck pussy. And leave me be. Fine, I get it. Everyone's got. Made it all the way here, huh? Must really want to talk to Evelyn. Hello, there's a line. Nah, -uh, you ain't cutting. Sit your ass down and wait your turn. Fingers guy, you know him? Heard some things, yeah. Like? His hand sometimes slips. Hey, what's that tone with me? What are you even doing here, Judy? Same thing as you. Looking for Evelyn. Mean to say, this whole time you knew Evelyn wasn't at Clouds. Who do you take me for? Why would I lie about something like that? Because you don't trust me. You're right, I don't. But that doesn't make me a liar. After the heist, Evelyn holed up with the Mox for a while, right? That's right. So why the hell she go back to Clouds? <sighs> Thought she'd be safer there. God knows why. Tried to get her to see straight, but she wouldn't listen. You talked to Fingers yet? If only. He's harder to get in to see than the best docks in town. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls, see if we can cut in front? Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. I think Evelyn's being kept here somewhere. On the one hand, hope she is, because I want her back fast. But on the other, hope to God no, because who knows what that sick fuck could have done to her. She means a lot to you, doesn't she? And you've arrived at that conclusion how exactly? The moment you knew where she was, you sprang into action. Once you get close to Evelyn, you never want to let her go. You worked at Clouds? Not as a doll. Tuned their virtues. That's where I met Ev, Tom, and the rest of the crew. Fingers. Where will I find him? He's operating on somebody right now. Been in there for ages. Shouldn't be much longer. Don't hold your breath. I spent hours waiting for him to come out. Especially when he collects payment right after the procedure. <laughs> Sorry, don't have time to sit around. Huh. <laughs> Now that makes three of us. Tell you what makes three. Number of seconds it'll take me to turn this place upside down. Inside out. Jeez, all right. You got nerve. Don't let me stop you if you're in such a goddamn hurry. Come on, let's go. Edges are stretching your optic nerves. Don't worry. I think he's done. We going in? Eventually. Yes, hello. What can I do for you? Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. I know she was here in your clinic. Ah, so that's what this is about. Where is she? Ah, a loaded question if I've ever heard one. You tiger claws? 
far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the Mox. The Mox? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? These girls know you're chipping faulty implants? You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. See? What's in it for you? Whatever they have to offer. And they always have something to offer. <laughs> You're a sick fuck. Know that? You're looking for a friend? <laughs> Heard you help the working girls around here. Well, very few children will play with broken toys. So when skin goes flabby, sockets go out of whack, implants malfunction, I'm sure you get the gist. You pay for goods, you expect top quality. Consumerism 101. Please, scrapyards offer better quality than this. Already told you. I'm looking for a woman named Evelyn Parker. Need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. To be flattered, praised, patted. To feel like... like they deserve it. Of course... Went jittery soon as I mentioned her name. Don't try getting out of this. I know you remember her. I have a neurological condition. It's not easy living with ticks. Really, I'd love to help, but if only I knew who you were talking about. Forrest. Name mean anything to you? No. Nope. They call him Woodman. Works at the dollhouse. You... you talk to him? Wasn't too happy about the way Woodman treated his employees. So I zeroed him. Not too fond of you either right about now. So careful what you say. Poor girl. Tried to help her, I did. But as you can see, this isn't exactly a state-of-the-art facility. You mentioned you couldn't help her. Help her with what exactly? If I only knew, I wager she'd be standing here, happy and smiling. Instruction register on her chip was burnt to a crisp. Tried replacing it. Nothing. Damage was caused by a netrunner using homebrewed malware. Sounds about right. Get to the point. The point? Ah, yes. Well, I haven't the faintest idea where she is. Enough of this bullshit! What'd you do to her, you freak? Now, either you put a muzzle on this creature, or put her down. It's impossible to have a conversation with her around. Don't talk to her like that. She insulted me! Look, the quicker you spill, the shorter you'll have to put up with us. Now, Evelyn Parker, where is she? Could very well be on her way to becoming the next underground brain dance, darling. That's all I know. You sure about this? Four days I had her here. She was out cold in La La Land for practically every minute. It wasn't a slumber party. We didn't have pillow fights and promised to send each other postcards. What do you mean by underground? I don't know. I mean, I don't watch that sort of stuff. Snuff? XBDs? I told you I don't know. Where will we find her? How many times do I have to repeat myself? I don't know. I... I did what anyone in my place would do. When I realized I wouldn't be able to help her, 
patch her up, I called my fixer. Two guys came and picked her up the same day. Who'd you call? Who's your fixer? Wakako. Told her I had a busted doll with a BD implant to hand off. Where did they take her? I told you already. I don't know. They weren't the talkative kind, and I'm no gunk. I know better than to ask questions of people like that. You're no gunk? What do you think? Why'd all these girls come in here, let you grope around them? Think it's for your charm? Your caring attitude? They do it because they got no choice. And in the end, they despise you. They can smell you pathetic. These guys, what do they look like? Like you, me, anyone else in this city. Really now? They look like you? They look like the kind of guys you don't make eye contact with. One of them was a bearded fellow. The two that came for her didn't say anything about where they were going to take her, what they were going to do to her. Mentioned something about virtues with a moth, of all things. Said she'd be perfect for them, whatever that means. But that's really all I know. You ponder off like she was some fucking inanimate mannequin. Because that's exactly what she was. Need air. I'll be outside. Judy's right. People like you make this city a living hell. Day in, day out. You got what you wanted, didn't you? So get the fuck out of here! I let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Trust me, Judy. Compared to the pieces of shit I scrape off my shoe every day, Fingers doesn't come close to being half their brand of rotten. Got no fucking words, V. None. Don't worry. We'll find her, I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey! Keep it together. You wanna give up now? No. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. It's better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Dead said symbol bring anything to mind? Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This industry... I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous. But an XBD outfit'd be on the move almost always. It makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. It could be we'll see something to point us in their direction and one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me. I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. Has an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City, a domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Let me think for a sec. I think I'll try calling Wakako. Fix her fingers mentioned. Thought of an angle to run on her? Why would I need one? Even if she knows the studio's location, she's not gonna spill. Be putting her neck on the line. Huh. Okay. I'm buying the brain dance. We can analyze, play detective. Fine. Meantime, see if I can't find something on the NCP domain. I'll wait in the van.
Hello, you wanted to talk? If anyone wanted to see a jelly roll, they look for a brain dance. And look in the mirror. Oh, any particular sure. one? Logo on the casing, a Stop death's head moth. Whoa, now that's quicksand. So I would advise caution. Look at yourself fixed up with the rippers. Know who makes them? Where they scroll them? And do you know what a fixer does? Allow me to explain. Not only do I finalize transactions, I can accomplish the goddamn impossible. Which would be... Making sure the buyer, supplier, and ever-neglected intermediary not only keep their heads in the games, but keep their heads, period. So don't you ever ask me who, with whom, where, when, why, or how. <laughs> can you get me one of those recordings? No. But I have a pretty good idea who can. Who'd that be? There's a store on Jig Jig Street. It has a Pandora's box worth of crap inside. Try asking the owner. Thanks, Wako. Got something that'll keep you hard for hours. This one too. Slow down. Use your imagination. Why did... Looking for, uh... Something special. A brain dance to really... You mean... Smut? Nah, more... Hardcore. Won't find it here. But there's a guy on Jig Jig Street. Has a whole lot of peculiar flicks. And I mean peculiar. Yo, man, you trying to rip us off? I got four bags missing here. Looking for something wrong. That's the cut. Untouched. I got a Pablo. Don't like Raw's it? Take it up with him. Me. I ain't dealing What's your with edge? Pablo. I'm dealing with you. Want something that'll That means you and me, me got a problem. Really scramble the neurons. Now, you I could take the man. sidewalk with your Bare guts, but that boxing, wouldn't get me what I want. Shoot out black ops interrogations. Oh, you want to try? Go on, son. No, 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 no. I mean something like, you know, you know. Fetishes. No, come on, you know what I mean? No, I don't. Think I'd be doing this job if I could read minds? I want to know what it's like to, to kill somebody. See, wasn't so hard. So, got some classics from the last Corp War, or armed robbery if you're looking for something fresher. What are you looking for? What have you got? Virtues. Any special kind? Well, let me put it to you this way. Those who know, don't need to ask. Looking for BDs. A particular kind. Particular? You a badge? If I was a badge, you'd already be in cuffs while you sold the customer before me. All right, all right. Can't be too careful. What do you want? Give me the best of the best. The ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. Where do you get these scrolls? Said you weren't a pig. Just curious, that's all. Once you booted up your virtue, dare say your curiosity will be satisfied. People that make these, <laughs> obsessed with privacy. Never even occurred to me to ask where they're from. To which caution I probably owe the fact that I'm still alive, talking to you. Got anything that might interest me? Pleasure doing biz with you.
Hop in. Let me get everything prepped. You make sure the wreath's snug on you. You'll watch while I edit in real time. The old one, too. Ready when you are. I want you to describe what you see. My catch from the Besides chopping people up, they were scrolling XBDs. Ordinary box, Decker, Tanaka, and Roger's logo. Standard for a trash heap. Ordered recently. Your corp patch and the coveralls. Can't beat that rich synth got aroma. Cheap shit. Cold too. Mm-hmm. Buck a slice. Coffee was cold, like from the day before. Pizza looked fresh, though. So? Means someone's grabbing bucket slice regularly, which is not something someone does for the flavor and fresh ingredients. Pizza shares its DNA with styrofoam. Nobody's gonna slap across town for it. Okay, we're looking for an electric core power plant located near a bucket slice. EC used to have a big old complex in Charter Hill. Bucket slice chicks out, too. How can you be sure, though? Christ, it's hot. Thermal readings are off the charts. Keep looking. Shit like that before. Sounds like scavs to me.
was turned way up. Probably to drown out the screaming. Here we go. Old Electrocore power plant in Charter Hill. Gotta make do with this for now. Nothing else to garner from this scroll. No time to lose. We gotta go there. Definitely. Ride with me? Let's get going. On our way. Still can't shake it. That virtue sample we saw with the Death's Head Moth. If all they scroll is snuff, then... Stop it. They'd have to be utter gongs to waste her on something like that. What do you mean? We're talking about a girl who's not only a natural at what she does, but also has got a doll's implant. I mean, that's not a package you find lying out in the street. And here we are. We going in? Wait. Never did tell me why you're looking for her. How do I know you won't be any worse than whatever's going on in there? Doubt it's the best time to discuss this. Right about that. Should have just told me when I asked you the first time. I need to know your intentions are good. Simple. Gotta find out who hired her. Whoever they are, I need their help, and quick. Otherwise, I'm screwed. Figures. Wouldn't expect anything less from a merc. Great. I'm glad. Now can we go? Find us a way inside. I'll hang back, scan the subnet, see if there's any blueprints of the complex lying around. Join you as soon as I find something. Let's link on Hollow till then. All right. Going in. That's Evelyn. Just don't touch her. If she's recording, you'll scramble her brain. Wait until I cut her link. I see her. Cable two. Grab it and tell me. All right. Let's do this. Wait for my signal. Here goes. Ready? Now! Thank God. Ev? Evelyn, you hear me? She okay to be moved? No brain hemorrhages, damage to the spine? It doesn't seem to have any wounds. Guess we got no choice. What's wrong with her? Honestly, I don't know. She's got to be seriously traumatized. Uh, hey, Evelyn. I need you to tell me who hired you. Seriously, V? You gotta do this now? Let's get her somewhere safe. Fast, too. Which way? I sealed the doors and managed to power the elevators. Elevators it is, then. Time to lose, V. Gotta get her out of here. Come on, is it really that hard? Please, just one. For me? Fine, have it your way. Smoke to your lungs content. Ah, oh, finally. Something better than exhaust in the stench of the city. Don't tell me you don't feel it, too. We going in? What's there to wait for? 
Didn't go through hell and back just to stand in front of a door. Ah, shit! She's sleeping. Uh, at least I think she is. Her eyes are closed and she's not shaking anymore. I would have already killed her by now if I didn't feel so bad for her. How's she feeling? Use your imagination. That place sucked every last drop of humanity from her. It's not enough, she already gave up everything she had. I just kept taking more and more. She's in some kind of trance, like she's folded into herself. No reaction to her surroundings whatsoever. I really, really didn't want to poke around in her head. I did it for you. I just want you to know that. I need to talk to her. Listen, I know you've got some serious questions that she's got the answers to. I mean, if I were you, I'd want to know too. But it's just not gonna happen. She's completely out of it. You've got to be fucking kidding me. You're mad at her? Why? When you asked me to scour her behavioral chip, I was just about done dealing with your shit. Judy, I didn't have any I know. Other... It's okay. So I don't get why... You'll find out in a sec. I'll show you the virtue I found. Guessing you saw them already. Yeah. Had to wrestle to make sense of the whole thing. But I don't want to say anything and taint your perspective. You should go in with fresh eyes. How many BDs did you manage to rip? Two. Only one of them's intact. Understandable, though. The rest... Well, they're in the same shape as Evelyn right now. Okay. Show me. Give me a sec while I set the parameters. Guess we'll find out if our doll really did lose her tune. Come on, V. I'll be the first to admit, this does not look good. Hey. How you feeling? You need anything? I'm not here to nag. Just talk. I know it's a bad time, but I gotta ask. You got any idea how to remove the biochip? Or know anyone else who might? Listen, Evelyn. I really need your help. It's important. If I don't do anything, and do it soon, I'll die. You're right. This is a complete waste of time. Well now, look at you. Have a seat. All right, roll it. Data was in pretty rough shape. Not all that editable. Huh. Glad you managed to salvage them in the first place. Needs a second to load. Quality's lousy, but I did like. <laughs> What am I looking out for? Every single piece of tech I see? Security? We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the Virtue. What about his messages? Only if you can do it and be parfait, Boris. It's most important that he suspect nothing. Try to be your usual relaxed self. And if he starts talking about the biochip himself, uh, should I... Bioship? Will you hear this? That is not of interest to you. You spin the virtue, you come back here. We give you the eddies. That is your one job. The rest is none of your concern. Understand.
What am I looking out for? Buy a little new every single. Take a look around if you want. Can't see your face. <sighs> Under normal circumstances, that kind of encryption's easy to crack. But not this time. Whoever she is, she's got serious net running skills. That or someone's working it for her. Security. We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the virtue. What about his messages? Only the captain. It's most important that he suspect nothing. Try to be your usual relaxer. And if he's a biochip himself. Not be important. Maybe. All of them are from Pacifica. Now's down our search at least. Uh, should I Bioship? Where you hear this? That is not of interest to you. You spin the virtue, you come back here. We give you the eddies. That is your one job. The rest is none of your concern. Understand. What am I looking out for? Every single piece of tech I see? Security? We need a lit. What am I. Hmm. I think I recognize these. What are they? Vive markings. You familiar with them? Not enough to know what they actually mean. Heard of who might use them, though. Who? Could be the Voodoo Boys, but that's just a hunch. Can't be 100% sure. The spine chilling Netrunner crew? Hard to find because they don't want to be. I wouldn't know where to start. What now? Looks like I'm going on a field trip to Pacifica. All right, I think we got everything. What do you think? The woman who hired Evelyn. Any idea who we're up against? Your guess is as good as mine. Sorry, V. Now we know what happened to Clouds. They're the ones who tried to flatline her. Launched a nuke at her ship. So it was punishment? For getting played by her? She knew more than they thought she knew. Couldn't let that go. So that's who she was running from. Looks like Evelyn never told us the whole truth. You're telling me? If I'd known what she'd gotten herself into? Oh, I'm so mad at her. Her only job was to record a virtue. It's pretty damn amazing she managed to organize a full-blown heist. And swiped a biochip from under her boss's noses. So that's where you came in. She hired you. And brought this all on herself. On you two. There's one more recording. Wanna see it? Sure, why not? Nothing can surprise me at this point. Oui, we are going to take a reason to be too intelligent for that, to protect you. We are not going to be C'est le plus bon moyen de nous gagner pour nous arriver sur le grand nombre. Il faut que nous prenions chance là. Vous gagnez un plus bon leader? Très bien. Si vous décidez si c'est bon critique et ça me pense, à continuer à faire le travail. Quelle langue est-ce qu'elle parle? Je ne sais pas. Les Haitiens Creole? C'est les Voodoo Boys. Je ne sais pas. Wait, let me see if I've got an auto-translator. Meantime, you try to tune in to the phone's frequency. See what the other side's saying. Try it. 
Try scanning the phone. We. We are We're taking it. Got it. Give it a second. Heard her mention Yorinobu. Probably why Evelyn buried this recording deep. Cut another name. Something like Silverhand? We have to know what they're saying. It could be important. Fine. Just found the auto translate package. Should get along fine with your system. I'll install it now. Si vous pouvez déjà aller. Oui. Oui, allez. Vous avez bien raison, mon Dieu, tout intelligent pour ça, pour te dire bien. Vous pensez que mon Dieu a fait un problème? Mon Dieu n'est pas enragé. Mon pli, c'est le plus bon moyen de nous gagner pour nous arriver sur nos bouts. Il faut que nous prenions chance là. Je vais vous dire que j'ai vu que Sylvain a fait un direct sur Alt. Vous avez une plus bonne idée? Très bien. Si vous décidez si c'est pour que je pense, je vais continuer à faire le travail. Okay, Judy, we're good. All right, disconnecting. I don't get it. What's this have to do with Johnny Silverhand? He died, like, forever ago. V, you got any idea? Long story, trust me. Go ahead. I'm all ears. Now's not the best time. Can you give me a minute? I need to go over some stuff in my head. Uh, um, of course. Know who they are, who the woman is. Any idea how we find them? Fuck, V. I've been dead the last half century. Sorry if I'm unable to hand you all the answers on a chrome fucking platter when you snap your fingers. These people, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that Netrunner. Finding her is our biggest priority. If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. Thought you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that Juju Wirehead, okay? Wait, you got any idea how to get in touch with the Voodoo Boys? Why? Worried they'll give Evelyn up to him? No. I didn't trust you at first, but... Well, if you wanted to get back at Evelyn, you would have done it already. So why the worried look? I just... I want it all to work out for you. You got a plan? I'll ask around, make a few calls. Let me put it this way. The Voodoo Boys wouldn't trust a cat if it walked onto their turf. But someone's got to know a way in. Well, good luck. I hope you won't need it. Thanks, Judy. No, V. Thank you. You're... You're a good person. Evelyn could never see what was under people's skin. If she could have gotten to know you a bit better, then... Who knows? Things might have turned out differently. Need to make contact with the Voodoo Boy's chief if he can swing it. All right, all right. Straight to heavy business. Hmm. Now, that'd be Maman Brigitte. It'd be tough getting a word into her. Huh. I was led to believe you could arrange anything. Ah! Now that sounded like my third wife every time she wanted a new purse. Maman Brigitte. And that sounds like a spooky cult alias. Have not had the pleasure of asking her personally, but it is what everybody calls her. Doubt the title has any real religious weight, though. Voodoo boys play pretty fast and loose with their Haitian heritage. You really don't do any biz with them? 
Not with the chefs, chefins, priests, and whatnot. All got dirigible-sized egos. Won't talk to lowly me. But if you insist, I can ask around, try to set something up. I'll just need some details first. Sorry, it's personal. Well, that's fucking helpful. Uh, got something they want. Truly? Want to sell something to the VDBs? Trust me, they don't want it, they don't need it. They're isolated, insulated, they got their own contracts, tech, networks. But, have it your way. Okay, I'll see what I can do and get back to you. V, consider this your lucky day. You hear Pacifica call and you make sweet love to it, that is. Got something for me? Well, it's like I said. Whatever you're peddling, the VTBS are just not in the market. But they have another task that needs doing. So I volunteered you. Do it well, and you'll get your audience with Brigitte. What's this task needs doing? What? You're gonna go picky on me now? The contact will fill you in on the deets. I got zero from him. Actually, got the impression I'd have to pay for every word out of his mouth. Okay. So who do I talk to and how? Hit the chapel on Sloan. Look for the altar inside. Someone will touch you, nod to you. Something spooky. Got it. Thanks. Say anything to continue. Hit me with it. While running a routine diagnostic check, I discovered a file with my owner's metadata. Name. Regina Jones. One by one. User, please return me to my real owner. Thank you in advance. Okay, I'll take you to Regina. You are the best user I know. Chum, I'm the only user you know. Your memory got wiped. Fun fact. There is a 92% probability Regina Jones will reward you. Hey, the name Skippy ring any bells? If it's in a holster, more than a little psycho. You have Skip? Little bastard got swiped a while back. Let me see him. Let's see how you're doing. Run diagnostics. Performance, 82%. Memory, damaged. Mode. Puppy-loving pacifist. Permanent lock. Permanent lock? Mmm, something's gonked. Return to factory settings. Please set pistol name. Mmm... Daisy. My name is Daisy. Wait, where'd you get this iron anyway? Eh, knew a guy. Everyone called him Danish. Great techie. I mean, before he started hitting the bottle. Anyway, poker game. Danish cleaned out his cred chip, then bet his gun. I think you can put together the rest. The combat features are great, but why the voice interface, you know? Weird as hell. So, something for my trouble? Sure. Here you go. It feels kind of weird now. It's too quiet. Hmm, maybe you should get a dog. Maybe. Someday. See you, Reggie.